Hey everyone, it is the Charming Giraffe and today we are going to do a viewer request even though it's not Thursday. I got a request on the YouTube channel for a Valentine's Day pour that involved hearts. So we're going to do two different types of ways to do hearts. Um, one I've never done, so we're going to test it to see how it works. Um, and the other one actually I don't think I've done successfully. So again, we're going we're gonna to play around with it and hopefully we get something really cool. The first one we're going to do, both of these are covered already with uh, Artist Loft Flow Acrylic White and the other two colors we'll be using is this burgundy this is the burgundy one not the not burgundy <laughs> um, and we're gonna do a string pull as you can probably tell my string got a knot in it <laughs> hmm we'll make that work um, and then the other color we're using is red by Artist Loft Flow Acrylic. That'll be for the next pour, which will be a Dutch pour. So, string pull. I've done it once. It didn't. It wasn't successful. So we'll see. This is going to be upside down for you, and I apologize on both of these videos. So I'm just going to kind of do like half a heart. Oh man. The, uh, the string touched right there. We might have to touch that up. But so far the half a heart is relatively correct. Let's see if we can get a heart here. Not a terrible heart, actually. I'm going to take this old glove, which I'm getting paint on as we speak. I was trying to like do a balloon smash <laughs> in hopes that that would like remove some of that paint there. I'm going to take the same string. I didn't like redip it and like pull it through again. Let's see if that helps. Oh. All right, all right. Not not too sure, but it definitely looks like a heart. Um, I'm going to try to add some white here to get rid of that line. So, pretty good. Here, let me point it towards you. Then I'll show you a close-up when we're done. The next one's a Dutch pour. Haven't done this either, so this is 100% playing it by ear here. So my idea is to pour a puddle and kind of blow it one way and then blow it the other way and maybe it'll make a heart. Maybe. I'm going to actually put the lid back on. Because I don't need a lot of paint. So I'm just going to squeeze it out of this instead. And I've got the little mini blower so we'll see if this will create enough wind power to blow this paint around. Oh, yeah. was not the problem me making a heart shape a little bit but it kind of worked we definitely have a heart shape so yeah hopefully this will the viewer will be happy with these let me um, bring you down for a close-up all right here we are for the close-up we'll start with the string pull we've got some cells coming through here I like the idea of running that through a second time definitely turned out pretty cool and then here is the Dutch pour I just blew it around less heart shaped but it was my first attempt so I'm pretty happy with it got a few cells and it's really bright I like it against that pure white background and only using one color yeah let me know what you think of these pieces in the comments below thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe like and share and do what makes you happy